Hey guys and gals, it's Triple L, and now welcome to another Shrine Guide for Zelda Breath of the Wild. This time, we're somewhere in the Tabantha region. We're about to go for a shrine that's hidden beneath the ground. There is a special trigger mechanism to get this shrine going, but I'll show you that once we get the shrine out of the ground. Right now, let's just take off all your clothes. Link has to go nude for this to work. As you will see, it will trigger a sequence. The sequence will trigger and you will get the shrine to pop out of the ground. Let's see if I can... Uh, this is gonna take a while. Shrines are notoriously slow. Yep, yep, yep. Mm -hmm. Shrine. Yeah. We're almost there. Excellent, great. The shrine is now out of the ground. Now, in regards to what is actually going on, we're doing the shrine crest under a red moon. And that's the big trigger. You need to do this when the moon has gone red. So really, the moment you realize this thing is there, just go towards the Tabantha region. It's towards the bluff. Uh, yeah, the bluff. And now we're inside. Let's see what kind of trial we got to deal with. Mija Roki. Mm -hmm. Oh, what? Oh, no. No. It's a combat trial. Oh, man. Oh, screw it. We're just going to go nude for this one. We're just going to do this. Guys, let's just get this trial out of the way.
and we're done great great good stuff wow okay so you know pick up the regular um gear that the guardian drops off and just get ready we're pretty much done let's go see what the treasure test for this shrine is hopefully it's something good let's see what's in the treasure chest the frost blade okay you know i'll take it my inventory is full but you know i'll take it Anyway, whatever. The shrine is complete now. You just go over and talk to the good old monk and you're good to go. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. This has been a short little combat trial. It went relatively well. I think we did great. So, guys, till next time, I hope you have a great day and uh, keep on fighting nude.